Welcome to Alumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. In today's video, we're going to talk about the nine benefits of heating your modern homestead with a wood stove. The first one is the freedom it offers you from your heating and electrical bills. Heating with a wood stove, if you have to buy the firewood, it's still cheaper than heating oil or electricity. But even better yet, if you have a wood lot, you can get all your firewood for free. And if you don't have your own wood on your land, you can round it up pretty easily. And you can save huge on your heating bills. One of the big deciding factors on heating with a wood stove for us was is if we lose power, we don't have to worry about not having heat or not being able to cook with our wood stove. This wood stove right here, it heats with natural convection, it takes no electricity. It's not a wood cook stove, but we can still heat hot water or cook a pan right on top of it. All this talk about cooking on my wood stove has gotten me hungry. Now that's a perfectly cooked egg. Now can you do that with your oil or propane furnace? Definitely not if you don't have any electricity. Worst case scenario, if we had to, we had a nice big bed of coals on the inside, I could put a Dutch oven in there and I could bake anything or cook a big meal that way too. We have our wood stove in the basement right next to our exterior door to go outside. So in the winter time, spring, fall, it's perfect. When the inclement weather, it's raining out or it's snowing out, you got all wet, we come right in here through our basement door, take off our gloves, our boots, leave them right by the wood stove and they dry instantly. And then another great thing, the way we have our basement set up, and we did this on purpose, we designed the house so the wood stove would heat the whole house easily. We got our laundry room over there and I got a clothes dryer. So we can dry our clothes virtually for free in the winter time just from the heat that the wood stove puts off and we don't have to rely on our dryer anymore. Then again, if you lose power, we already talked about it, you can cook with it, you can heat your house, you don't have to worry about that. And also, you can boil water anytime you need to. Or you can melt snow, say you run out of water. It's not the most efficient way to get water, but if you run out of water, you don't have anything to drink, not only are you going to be able to melt water, you're going to have warm water for bathing or cooking, making tea, making coffee. A wood stove is just full of so many resources it can supply you with. You just need to think out of the box a little bit. Talking about the endless things you can do with a wood stove, right here is a hot water jacket, hot water loop, whatever you want to call it. I have it for our stove, but we haven't hooked it up yet. This would go in the stove like so, on the inside, and then the other ends come out, and you would thread pipes onto it. You'd have a hot water tank on one side of your stove. This would be inside, the water goes through here. Through natural convection, it's just going to keep circulating your water through your wood stove into your hot water heater tank and then you're going to have an endless supply of hot water without electricity too. We haven't had a chance to set it up here, but when we do, it's going to be amazing. And then you might be thinking, oh that's all great, but they're such a mess. You get all the wood ash. What are you going to do with that? Well, I'll tell you what, that wood ash, you can do plenty of good things with it. Believe it or not, it's awesome for your garden. You can add it directly to the garden bed. You can add it to your compost. Then you can just put it in a metal bucket and save it, and believe it or not, Another thing you can make out of your wood ash is lye. I'm not going to talk too much about that in this video, but if you'd like to hear more about it, leave it in the comments and I'll make a video on it. But using your wood ash, you can make lye, and we all know you need lye for making soaps. Last but not least, it's better for the environment. We're not, we don't have to get all the fossil fuels out of the ground to heat our house. So a wood stove offers a lot of freedom to me and my family. There's a lot less worrying we have to do if the power goes out. We're always going to have a nice warm house. I'll see you right back here next Saturday at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and check us out on Facebook.